we are the Gator Boys. With Scott and Trey helping me out, we can actually make a lot of progress and get all these branches cut down before hurricane season hits. Get all this stuff loaded up, back up the truck, we'll pull that big one down, we're done for the day. All right, I'll be back in like 20 minutes, half hour. Paul had to take a little break, so me and Scott decided to finish up the job so we can earn a few brownie points and show them who the real men are around here. Trey, are you sure this is going to work? It'll work. All you have to do is worry about cutting, I worry about the rest. I've seen this done a hundred times. I know exactly what I'm doing. Drop it and let it swing and drop it down slow, but the rope must have broke. Dude, the windshield is shattered. <sighs> I don't even I... want to see the roof. You think Paul's going to be mad at me? I'm just glad it wasn't me. kidding me, right? My life is absolutely insane. I, I got four or five knuckleheads around here. What do you mean it's doing? I, I didn't mean it to fall on the truck. I wanted it to swing to the side of the truck. Oops. Oops. You know, Paul probably wants to be left alone but I thought maybe by going on a gator call, it might make Paul feel a little bit better. Right this way. Your chariot awaits. Be quiet and drive. You know, I've been waiting a long time for this. You know, I don't like Jimmy's truck. Big mud tires jacked up. This is too much. You look good in this. Thanks. You look good. <laughs> you know, I think it's actually pretty funny what happened to Paul's truck because now he has to ride in a real man's truck. <laughs> 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 